U18 to win the draw back. For the Will Smith, for the Americans. Quick shot there and a goal. Ryan Leonard is second of the game. And just like that, it's a two to one. My dad worked at UMass and he was the basketball coach there. And one day my mom brought my brother the ring for learn to skate and he got into hockey and they put me on skates when I was young and the rest is history. I loved it right away, being on the ice, having fun, skating as fast as you could. It was just awesome just skating around as a kid. Ryan Leonard grew up in Amherst, Ryan Massachusetts, Leonard. where hockey became a huge factor in his life. The 17-year-old center plays for the United States National Team Development Program and is a top prospect in his draft year. Key areas to his game have gotten him to where he is today. I'm power forward. I'll do whatever it takes for the team to win, whether it's playing a skill or skilled game or playing third, fourth line role. I'll do whatever it takes. I feel like my speed and my vision could always be better. Um, I like my shot where it is and I like my physicality, but some things always can be tweaked a little bit. The selflessness he has in his game helped land him a spot on the NTDP, where the moment he found out he could make the team is one of the most special ones he carries with him. Um, getting to the rink for the first time when 40 camp was, and had a meeting with my dad, and they told me I could make the team if I wanted to, and me and my dad both looked at each other and we had a good smile on our face. So. It's a great moment for the both of us. Leonard is committed to Boston College where he'll play beginning next season, which is a dream come true for a kid from the East Coast. It's been a dream of mine since I was a little kid to play in the Bean Pot and being recruited by them, going to see the campus for the first time, fell in love with it right away, and that's one of the most special moments of my life. Ryan Leonard's hockey journey truly is just getting started, but one moment on his path is what made him realize he wanted to make a career of the sport. I feel like when I was 10 years old and went to the Brick Tournament in Edmonton, Alberta, that's when like me and my family realized that, hey, we're going to give this a try, and I loved every moment of it, and it's a sport I love now. So 